Daisies, it's time, it's time. Freaking 45 seconds until greatness, am I right? Until the greatness occurs, until we are all blessed with the perfect update. Let's get excited, let's go. If I can't get excited by other things in the game right now, I have to use all my excitement for what's to come. What are they gonna fix? What's changing? I have to. A three, a two, a one. Let's go. Get out of here, bugs. He's getting nerfed anyway. Hello and there they welcome are. everybody to They look like they don't get much sleep. A fellow community manager, Nikat, how you doing today, man? Nikat, oh yeah, it's his first time. I'm super excited about season 3.5 and super happy to be here to bring it in with you, of course, Ajax, where we let the players know exactly Too bad they're what not, is coming. They're not on the couch. Short, uh, nice. in-depth guide that's going to be coming in right from Nikat himself. Uh, the interview I'm going to have my own guide. Director, uh, of course, we'll be taking your questions at the end too, so make sure that you are dropping you your questions. You never answer my Discord. questions. It's the world premiere of Nubia's gameplay trailer. Take a look. Let's get into Let's it. Go! Let's go! Whoa! A whole trailer. The Staff of Understanding. By the might of the gods, I am Nubia! How is this fair? Get up. <laughs> this is my competition? Assassin. We already knew that, but... Oh my god! She uses her. I understand her staff now. Oh my! A better banana guard. Not underestimate me. Get shit on. Samurai Jack. <laughs> Armored. Armored attack. She just. She's carried by the spear. Whoa! That skin. Ready, sister. Let's that skin this. as well. The hairstyle is fantastic. You know what isn't fantastic? How overpowered she is. I can literally do this all day. Yeah, Powerpuff Girls, we need I'm your help. Some real imposter syndrome. Don't yeah, feel bad. <laughs> I told you. I Better ready. banana guard. Better banana guard. Oh, she's nice. Tomorrow through a bundle. Uh, Gleamium and character tickets and fighter currency on the 18th. And of course, we can't have the queen without talking a little bit about the voice that brought it to it, Nikat. Yes. Ooh. Thank you so much. Who's the cat? Who voiced her? Nubia oh, okay. to life. Such powerful, wow. powerful voice acting, typical of a queen. And something to note, by the way, Ajax, it was is good. that I really community manager in the cat. And today I am here to talk to you about Nubia, the latest addition to the multiverse roster. That. And so jumping Against straight Wonder into Woman, it, Nubia boss. is an assassin class character with a lot of speed and a long range weapon with wow. her spear. I didn't know that. She is known for being aggressive and she, in my opinion, is one of the more aggressive characters in the game, especially coupled with the range of her spear, you making her a, been a very, very formidable character an opponent going straight into it nubia's dash attack is a lunge wow. forward with her spear she has Holy a little bit of startup shit. on this move so you will be able to react to it however with the range on this move to make it up seems for pretty it, fast. especially at higher damage ratios she will actually have significant knockback to knock away an opponent and just the range oh to God, actually the range this move over and over the range the is making me the next move that i'd like to talk die. about is nubia's forward attack on the ground so forward attack is a two-part attack right you can get really close to the opponent and do it or if you want oh, really? you can try to space third, away three hitter. from the opponent and hit with the second one intentionally, Makes or sense. you could try to hit with both hits. It doesn't really matter. The good thing oh, about this move is being able to link this move into other grounded options, and of course, branch into other combos in the air. Whoa. She has many routes with this move, so please feel free to explore how this move is going to work and how oh. you're going to use it to punish the opponent. Lightning! Black Adam. The next Black move I'd like been to talk training about is Nubia's grounded down attack. This move pops up the opponent, and if you charge this move by holding down the button, oh. thunder erupts from the ground that will actually pop the opponent up, and you will be Shaggy's able to been combo teaching her. out of that as well. So use this move to the best of your ability to try to set up situations where flying. you will be able to ring out an opponent, or you'll be able to get good damage because Nubia's combo game is very, very strong. Whoa! The next move I'd like to talk about is Nubia's neutral attack. Huh. Nubia's neutral Kick. attack is a lunge forward with the spear that has a lot of range oh. and is very, very horizontal based. 
So if you use this move, just know that there is quite the commitment to using it, but there has to be due to just how far this move is yeah. able to reach and hit an opponent. Agreed. And of course, at higher damage ratios, it is able to ring them out. So Gotta jump keep up in a mind lot. also that you can charge this move to not only make it come out at a later time, but to give it even more power. And the last grounded normal attack that we want to talk about is Nubia's up attack, which swipes the opponent upward, allowing you to create a lot of situations where you're able to either it's ring like out a faster opponent, banana guard. you're able to combo and apply more vertical pressure. This move, as shown before, is able to combo out of grounded oh side attack. My God. So be sure to use this move oh my to the best God. of your ability, as well as take advantage of its range. You know, if an so many people are going to man you. This is a good move to knock them up in a way you know someone's gonna mean that so many people are gonna mean now her. getting into some of Including nubia's me. grounded special attacks nubia extends her spear as far as possible grabbing the opponent from a long distance you can do the same thing in the air as well and it will actually pull you toward the opponent uh, allowing you to actually hit them it it's is the a very well. very committal option so you want to make sure that if you are using this move it's mostly off of a read if your opponent likes to dodge a lot or of course if your opponent wants okay. to air dodge specifically a lot the thing you will is be able to catch them off stage and bring them if out i have, the if side. i have to respect the move to dodge it pressure to be done can i get to her to punish her in time you know what i'm saying well. The next special attack I'd like to talk about is Nubia's side special. So if you use grounded side special towards the opponent, you will actually leap toward them and hit them. And this will allow you to also pressure off stage, whether you're in the air or of course on the ground using the move. This move is a gap closer and it's just very good to be able to lunge at your opponent at that speed and at that distance. So she doesn't to need a dodge jab. Form of pressure. Let's get into Nubia's perks. Nubia has two very strong perks that I'd like to share with you all. The first perk I'd like to talk about is Staff Mastery. When you hit an opponent with the tip of Nubia's spear, you will actually hear a sound indicator that shows that you hit them with the absolute tip of the spear, landing a tipper, which increases the knockback of Nubia's moves and also applies shock. Also, when equipped with this perk, because there is a tipper mechanic now in place, combos and follow-ups will now be just ever so slightly different than the non-tipper natural counterpart without the perk use this to the best of your ability to score early ring outs and of course to land new combo routes the final perk of Nubia's that I'd like to talk about is Cold Sight. The way Cold Sight works is when you tipper an opponent three times you will actually stun them in place as you see, I am able to now follow That's up and you have quite a bit of time 100%. to follow up with your opponent being stuck in place. Keep in mind, if you try to apply a stun immediately after already stunning the opponent, you will not be able to get a stun and you will have to wait some time before that indicator pops up above the opponent, allowing 100% you to stun that perk is being in place. used no matter what. Another thing to note is that even if you do stun them again, Let's say I get the stun right here. If I do nothing and the opponent just fought, flies away, they will retain the same amount of, I want to say, knockback. No way, dude. Depending on the move that they got hit with. No way. So they way. don't just fall to the ground. So they're like, stunned right and then stunned they again. They retain That's that stupid. knockback that they got that from the last stupid. move and they will be sent flying. So whether you want to do this in style or you want to do this to ring out an opponent in a cool way, or a way that is more optimal, it is up to you as the Nubia player. And that's going to be it for the Into the Verse Nubia gameplay like breakdown. If you want to see the rest of Nubia's moves and how they work, please check us out on the official Multiverses YouTube channel and be sure to like that video and subscribe move. to the channel. Like, the what do you do for that? Down means special a special? ton. This is your community manager, Nakat, over at Player First Games, and I greatly appreciate being able to do this guide for you. And if you have any the questions, range, please the let speed. me know gonna throw it back to the studio you all have a great rest of the episode she's gonna be very and strong thank you so much in the cat for such an awesome breakdown of such an <laughs> aggressive character this character is wild but you already know what time it is uh you know oh. nubia looking awesome and incredible and we have of course a lot of other things to talk a lot about of other things to talk about guys uh, 3.5 maybe mid-season but it sure feels like a full season that's what i'm saying that's what that's what you about. guys were saying first thing so first, 
uh, you know, we, we, of course, have revealed uh, prior the Townsville version 2 map, which is the destroyed Townsville. You can see that there's a lot of stuff going on in the background. Please make it a ranked uh, map. Up girls were a little late to help things out. But we did say <laughs> stages for a reason. Because you, you hid one. There are quite a few. You uh, hid we one. Have gone and added a bunch of different Whoa! variations to other stages, much like what That's we just way had. better. Yeah, Dexter's Lab number three. Uh, and also we have gone and added a majority, a majority of all of the individual modules that you okay. see in the Dexter's Lab rotation map. And a big part of it those is because we wanted to improve some casual fun, a little bit of chaos, bring some things to free for all. Like those should be uh, in casual. We have, you know, we, we have the ability to kind of mess around with additional things, so why not? Including PVE happens to have some additional things. Oh, and we also have Trophy's Edge number three, which merges the two platforms together. So oh. you have a mobile uh, mobile platform that is going to go across the center now. Okay. And like I was just alluding to, PVE has uh, a bunch of unique uh, individual maps too, which we decided. Uh -huh. Why not mess with those two? So we have the space map here, which is another triple place platform map. We hey. have the beach map, which uh, has four different uh, platforms, which are going to go across the entire stage. And of course, we also have a bunch of individual chaotic maps that will be coming along with that too, much like the hammer time stage. This is not the only ones. I think there's at least like four more. Uh, so instead of just one map, we decided to add, I think, like 12. <laughs> A bunch. Nice, Which one is your favorite? dude. Finally, uh, people are not liking the platforms. Really cool. Overall, uh, I think with, it's better uh, to have more stages. Our and the new rift, which includes the hunter on the trail, which is going to be starting tomorrow. Uh, when uh, we go live with 3.5, uh, you will be Any hunting rift changes? down the hypergalactic uh, crew, which uh, a couple of you have seen us dude, teasing so far. Uh, once again, Stripe is insane. the Dia de los Muertos event. That will be hey! starting tomorrow Whoa! as well. Uh, there's a super skin. skin His hair is glowing. Green, green hair. And oh. then, of course, there is a unique skin uh, for Rain Dog that just looks amazing. I actually can't remember the exact Get name. Get out of here, Rain head. Dog. I don't know if I, I want his hat. To pronounce it. I want that. <laughs> Superman. I do. I do want that hat. Actually, want to get. Uh, oh like, yeah, the hat. Like, yeah, these all look incredible. Um, I personally See, they don't even want Rain Dog. They just want the hat. That's probably... That means he's not going to get the also, Galaxy skin. Course, Shit. Uh, Twitch drops usually occur right around this time. It's a little bit different this time around because it happens to be a certain time of the year. If you want to go ahead, explain to everybody what we got coming up for that. Absolutely. So from October 26th to 10 a.m. PST through October 28th through uh, 10 a.m. PST, we will be doing a Twitch drops event in the form of a 48-hour Scooby-Doo nice! movie marathon. Y'all know how good the Scooby-Doo movies Let's are. Go! Come on, be real. What's your favorite one, chat? Let us know. Uh, the rewards you'll be able to grab are, but it has three bathrooms profile icon, 100 Gleemium, and a Mystery Ink Shaggy skin. You'll be getting this exactly... Uh, you, well, you'll be able to see these really soon. I'll just put it that way. Dude, that's yeah, so that's sick. Too often we they get to, actually uh, got it again. They heard the feedback. Of... So make sure you check that out. Of course, Scoop Scooptober is always a good time. In the beta, and, you know, being Scooptober, it's they right had the same Halloween, event where you watch uh, Scooby Doo and shows. And, what would be and now they're going to do it again. Because we have the Halloween event that's oh, coming up as go! well, which has some of my favorite skins that I have been wanting to talk about for a while. We finally get to talk about. What is that? They're dressed up as the characters. Look at Tom and Jerry. Just, just look Joker up. and just Batman. Like, oh my God! Like, you, how, yeah, Joker Jerry. That's too. Like, it, it, just joke. It's. It, I don't know if you're mad or so happy. Good. It's so good because you fit, like, like just. You got. I, I need Bugs it. Bunny, I need Superman. Superman. You got the Steven Universe. Uh, Shaggy oh my Skin. God, you got Marvin disgusting. the Martian, Banana Guard, uh, Bugs Bunny as Superman, and the Tom and Jerry skin there. Um, it looks like. I just. Hold on, I, hold on. Who oh, is oh, Jason? I mean, you, you see him looming though, right in the background. You see, you see him, right? Oh, oh, who, those oh, candles. Who, oh, who is that? I wonder what. That? I wonder what skin he has. Oh, we, oh, we have to, we have to find out a different time. Now, uh, we have wait a minute, not just what? the events, of course. Uh, now oh, it's time the Jason. to start talking. Of if there could be a cue that's uh, more based on being able to kind of relax, chill, have a good time, the mini games, log in, get a couple missions, the done, mini games, do some quick stuff with their friends. Well, that is on its uh, way because we are going to be introducing uh, the casual queue tomorrow, uh, which is going to start off as uh, players versus bots. So you get to go in there and okay. uh, just go ahead and that's play different. Some a lot of people have been asking for that. Done, practice against hard mode bots with your teammate and just kind of relax and chill. Uh, we we have heard a lot of what people have been asking for. We paid close attention. So yes, the uh, casual queue will be starting off. 
with uh, players versus spots. But that's not the only thing that it will have in the uh, in the, the uh, coming patches. There will be additional modes that will be joining in on that too, and uh, that's something you'll be able to see all the time. So please go nice. ahead and enjoy. Somebody I don't know who uh, has been talking a lot about chaos lately, like a lot of chaotic things. What has been going um, on I have with no this? Clue who that is? Uh, but uh, we are pretty He's... big fan of chaotic, wild. And perhaps wacky things. Wacky. Uh, I think that's the word you're looking for. We'd like to introduce to you Wacky Weekends, which are going to be getting actually tomorrow. You get to drop, hop in tomorrow what the and hell? try out Slay the Giant, amongst many. Oh, look, there are a lot. Let's just get, let, we've got to go <laughs> Slay the Giant. Of course, we have that's not fair. Requested one that people have been asking for. Nice. Volleyball. The volleyball, volleyball dude. Volleyball. Uh, volleyball. There Let's is. Go. Let's freaking go. What, what else we got? Hold on, wait, wait, wait. I, I forgot. I spread, I spread these out a little bit. Let's see. Let's go ahead and take it in. We have uh, Splat, which is personally one of my surprise favorites. Uh, every time you get knocked back <laughs> against something, you get stuck. What? Uh, it is hilarious, and it's just chaos. Uh, there is also a bunch of oh, this, mutators uh, that you might have seen before, much like Spotlight. Um, the the what horror, is that Morty uh, skin? Like the the filter one. There is a uh, Lazarus pit. There's a Bunch of other different nice, ones. Nice, the Mario Kart is oh also my going gosh. to be joining. You have of the four-player PV. It's just a no-brainer. Kart racing, they'll be able to do, and uh, I just uh, and also this one is as chaotic as well. Oh, there's also, are different skins as well. Doctor. I think somebody called the doctor. Uh, there is a lot, a lot of fun, uh, different mutators and different things that will be joining Wacky Weekends. Which again, you'll be able to try it out tomorrow when things start going on. What was going on with Finn's uh, up special there? Oh, that's a little weird. Uh, <laughs> and, and, I didn't so, see it. And this is going to be all the time. Uh, but again, Friday through Sunday, Wacky Weekends is here to stay. Uh, and uh, a, nice. a lot, you know, it's going to at least and, give uh, some of course, variety. Coming in the near future, you will also be able to do custom game mutators uh, as well. So there will be a menu that will be added to the custom games where you'll be able to do your own individual mutators to be able to do these modes as well. So it's not live for 3.5 just yet. You'll be able to enjoy those all wacky weekends, but those are on the way in the near future. Gameplay At the changes, beginning of here we season go. three, we talked about this. We said that we they, were going they through uh, combat over. Uh, one of the main points of uh, conversation people always have, of course, hit boxes. are the hitboxes and the hit reacts. And we're oh, going to break those oh, down right now. So hit reacts. For many, if you take if you take a close look at when Samurai Jack is kicking the neutral attack to your left, it looks like he got hit much further away because at the very moment when you get hit, it would play the hit react animation, put you in that crumpled state and pull you away and make it look like you didn't get hit. So what we have tuned is the hit react animation. So now it'll hold it a little longer. So you'll be able to see uh, as that hit is actually happening, it's gonna provide less confusion and be able to uh, have a lot more matches where if you happen to be crossing someone up and you got caught, you'll be able to see why. And that's not to say also, that okay. this is the only thing we had to address. Uh, hit mm -hmm. reacts have been done across the entire Dark cast, skin, and we have uh, started a pretty large pass and a larger pass to come in the near future on hitbox changes too. You take a look here, there's <laughs> uh, there a couple moves that extended a little bit too far past where uh, the initial uh, view Agent of where you would think you get hit would go. So oh we have God. altered many. Uh, one you can see Agent Finally, Smith here, of course, with the neutral special. Uh, air, the side special as well, the dive. A lot of people have pointed that one out. You will never ever be getting hit by Ada Smith at the backside of this ever body, again. Like yeah. while he's diving. <laughs> that 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 is yes. that is out. Um and uh, we've that is gone like one through, of the biggest uh, about a, a good majority of the boxes. cast already. Uh we do it, this does take a little bit of time so we do have a lot more characters still to go. But a lot of the uh, main figuring. ones that people have pointed out be eclipse or uh or anything like that. We have gone and addressed those so you'll see those listed. Uh, you should see also some more visually accurate ones um, and other ones that we will get to will keep you up to date. Oh, uh, man. But I know this is one that people talk about quite a bit. Uh, we're very happy to be able <laughs> yeah. to bring this to you now. I mean, like, and, uh, look at that. Bring a lot. I mean, I can't even just uh, believe that any, that got through. Across, the next up is uh, dodging as, uh, uh, as a whole uh, is um, something that both could be hit Wait. very uh, in places where it seemed like you shouldn't be but also the fact that you can act almost immediately out of it so we've added an additional 10 frames onto every single dodge that misses uh so if you dodge an attack just outright trying to run away from someone and then just kind of swing right away you have an additional 10 frames before you could do so this is going to help people who okay. back up I, like I, I was going to make a joke about it but we were just talking about it if you also <laughs> notice uncle shag 
It's shirtless now. But uh, and that's for a reason. The approach because for Superman to dodge jab. Not gonna, the approach uh, of dodge jabbing is well, not going to be so as you, viable uh, anymore. To that's use what they're that removing. For other skins, you can now use that across all of the shaggy skins. Uh, oh, okay. That is, uh, I was wondering if you could tomorrow, do that. You, and uh, I, honestly, sure. I'm just because that is sick. Uh, then overall, be good. Uh, and fast falling, uh, which people have been asking for quite a bit. Uh, we are progressively going to be not just this patch, but over the next patch to come. Uh, characters who had the ability to just constantly throw out like grounded up specials over and over again. I'm thinking Batman, Wonder Woman, uh, uh, Shaggy, comp a company like that. Uh, no longer. We so, have added more whiff to uh, multiple of those moves, and we're going to continue to keep track of those moves, too. Uh, we have also added more whiff to characters who have the ability to uh, constantly throw out grounded options that are pretty quick, mostly gems, um, that, and we're going to keep keep an eye on those all, uh, as well. But um, a lot of combat changes have come true. to that. Uh, we've also brought up other characters who were uh, falling a little bit behind the pack. Uh, all I'm going to say is uh, Jason is here to play. And uh, <laughs> nice. he's here to more than play. Uh, it, it's uh, it's you know it's, it, I, I think it, I think Jason it's uh, I, I think it's that I think it's that time. Probably I think it's the that perfect time month actually. Finn has also received a couple combat changes to uh, kind of go more of the aggressive approach, but not be able to go for zero to KOs as easy without really uh, removing a lot of the problem points. Uh, Batman, okay, uh, Tom and Jerry, and a couple others who are sitting at the top for a bit uh, have a couple things that are coming to them as well. Which we, the main goal is leveling the playing field. And you'll see all of that in the patch notes uh, to come. And uh, all right. we, we've heard a lot about how everybody uh, would like the ability to maybe try things out or give some feedback or give some testing. Oh, uh, before the experimental to testing. Well, uh, starting on the 24th, uh, on Thursdays, we are introducing what is called testing grounds. The very first thing we'll be testing is shields. Uh, we are looking to Whoa! get your feedback and see what you all think about some of our mechanics before we get them out there. That is freaking uh, and badass. And after that, we're also testing the idea of badass. what it would be like to have a shorter jump. Uh, and these badass. things could go to overall mechanics. They could go to quite a bit. See, people uh, don't aren't that, receiving you know, we the shields well, bit, but that's and, why they're uh, going to do the really, test. Really, really excited to be able to bring. That's this what together. I'm excited for. To yeah, where they so can the actually try is things. Much a culmination of we want the player base to be able to have a hand in the future of this game. And the best way to do that directly I is for chills. all of you to actually be a part of the process. When we want experimental I'm features or mechanics to enter the game, you all will be some of the first to be able to test those out and give us feedback. We want to know how you guys feel about shields entering multiverses and how they feel. I think that's Remember, fair. I think that's fair. Experimental, so exactly. there is a lot of room for improvement. It's not just yes. changing it, throw it without out there telling us. To test. It's and asking course, us. Again, give that's the difference. Time now People are Twitter saying too. no shields, and, and that's as fair. As said, the next one is but going to be try it. short hops, or rather just different jumping heights. So yeah. nice. Let us know how that's think another. About, uh, what y'all think about this? Keep an eye out for that. Again, the first one will be on October 24th. And, oh uh, nice we'll Thursdays, pretty we'll soon we'll get it's a huge again, way to well, chest we, we care about the players first huge we mechanics to to get that feedback from you directly that may not work and out and till Holy another time oh, this God. one shit this one Velma. happened like way earlier before we even All asked right. about it too like it was right at the beginning That's how, i gotta go the community is kind of pissing me off right now because they're like, oh no shields oh wow it's cooked oh wow trash yeah shielding might not work i agree with you it means so much more than you guys are making it out to be to be able to test the shields because we don't know for sure we just assume that shields might be bad for multiverses because of how it is but guess what it could be good depending depending on how they implement it maybe i don't want it to be like shields and like smash and stuff but maybe they could make it better so maybe where if you get hit in the back you won't block something so you could dodge through. Maybe you only get one shield per stock or something. I don't know. Being able to test it is so good. Zero nine nine Who is it? Nine L is our adventure time. Uh, uh, You're being called out, Moi, the multiverses account, uh, whoever and, that is. Uh, L art. Some fun art. This How one, about you I go? Love, I love the stay in bronze. Time this is as horrible. Well, Dude, people being are actually a lot of the usual so brain dead. Up, up, of I'm wow, not really lie. Good. That, Dude, again, people actually hating on art is insane. Dude, that looks sick though, Spartan Banana. This feels accurate with, uh, to what? Whoa. Yeah. Well, 
No, 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 I'm not gonna say anything. That, that, Wait, that, what? You know, it, you know this what TV glitched. That, fell down pony. that was intentional. That, this is super that unique. was this intentional. Is really cool. I like what's going on. What are they here. teasing? Uh, we have a submission from multiverses as well. Uh, yeah, Whoa! We got, I get there. I, I, who, who put that there? Hey, uh, so, multiverses skin. skin. What? Yeah, oh, like, that skin, it looked dude. Pretty, uh, pretty what is that skin? About the look. Uh, yeah, that actually is a really W emote. Um, I think we got to be able to create stuff like that. So there, simple. Yeah. Oh, who's this? Yeah, I think we, I think we saw this before. Oh, what are yeah, you gonna do? Shut up! Oh! 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 Shit! Oh! Yeah, it gives my also. Yeah. <laughs> it's time. No, I did a terrible job of trying to act surprised about that. We, we no way! Spell. That's so cool. <laughs> Question from Stress Inducer: uh, Projectiles that are dodged lose their hitbox and are unable to hit again, but still remain visible. You need to address that so that way, um, there is a fly. time frame of which you dodge the move. Uh, and then the projectile will not hit you. But if you get knocked into it again after that time frame is over, you will get hit by it. Uh, so yes, that it, it is. Sometimes Superman mechanic, fly, they'll dodge not, it um, like this. The, but then the, I'll go the through time frame which is don't lasting get is a little too long. It's only going to get better from here because uh, this oh, is yeah. not the only thing we got. We got some really exciting things coming up in the near future too. So if you're enjoying what we have for 3.5, just wait for what we have coming in the near future. A different special guest. Who would like to uh, say a few closing words so uh thank you everybody uh for joining a closing us guests take care enjoy 3.5 i'm not sure what the gods have planned with all this but we'll figure it out in time hey <laughs> marceline confirmed confirmed double confirmed because marceline if you do not know in adventure time she doesn't suck the blood she's a vampire but she doesn't suck the blood of her enemies she just sucks the color red out of things but crazies, there you have it. And I can't wait for the future of multiverses. I think it always goes steps forward. Maybe take a few steps back here and there. But I always know it's going forward and forward. It's just like, we want to get to the top of the stairs, you know? We're only halfway up. So it's just going to take time. Is this going to be enough to save or, or save multiverses? Probably not. It's a really good step in the right direction, as always. So that crazy, let me know what your guys' thoughts are down below. And I hope you have a fantastic day. With that, I say good night. And goodbye. Goodbye, crazies. Goodbye, crazies. Life crazies. Goodbye, crazies. Love you.